All right, Bob. So what do, you, what do we got going on here? Man, All right. Yeah, look at the windshield. Let's start oh, with yeah. the day. We're on day number four. The House of Hook, Carolina Dragway, in Aiken, South Carolina, or thereabouts. So we took break for Ned Dunphy in a pretty wild piece of video. Excuse me, Brian Lowndes. I'm trying to talk here. <laughs> kind of annoying. Uh, we're going to work on the plugs right now. I think we've got a, a plan. We bought a bunch of race fuel. We're going to try to run two pumps today and see if it's a fuel-related issue. That's why I'm running so slow. Hopefully that's all it is. We can maybe clean out a pump, the uh, filter element later and uh, make a good lick and get ourselves back in the running, hoping to get second place in our class. So, so how many passes do you hope to make today? I uh, hope to make one really good pass. One really and good then pass. We'll see about a second pass. In the staging lanes, we're getting close to 12, 12, 15. The track all of a sudden is down. Somebody had some carnage out there. Might have been the Viper. Uh, Unfortunately, some of the, sometimes you just don't get to see some of the cool racing. Staging lane coordinator that I get to race my good buddy in the beautiful 66, Jeff, at the Big G Garage channel. Wally Park, yeah. We're going to go heads up, and uh, as you see, I put it on him. He goes red, gives him a little bit of a lead, uh, but I walk him down and walk around him, and now he knows how it feels. He did that to me a handful of years ago uh, up in Wisconsin, and uh, I always felt bad. I mean, I got on him, and then he walked right around me back when he used to be big block powered. So it's nice to return the favor and actually get a win on him, uh, even though it doesn't count. It's just bragging rights, right? I mean, he's one of the people that got me into all this. And to be faster than him, it feels good. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, it feels good. Drag week, day four. Carolina Dragway, 2023. Racing's done, it's two o'clock. Bob Ruppel's here in the pits, putting his cart back into street mode. Bob, how do you think your performance was today? Originally, I wasn't happy with it, but there's this guy in the Chevelle always running his mouth about how fast he is. And I took him out. <laughs> Did you? What kind of Chevelle? The yellow one? That oh, guy? no, it's like some turd brown. It's, I don't know. <laughs> really? There's a guy like that. I have to look out for him. He's got these bead locks on there. So you think he's like super fast. Yeah, like anything with bead locks. locks. Yeah, I mean, you got 850. 850. Right, 850 or quicker if you got bead locks. That's probably this guy right here. Oh, don't tell him I said anything. <laughs> So what did it run today? We went 964, I believe. Yeah, what kind of mile an hour was it? I didn't even look. I'd have to look at my camera. Same. I took it to the thing and I look over the lady's shoulder and it looked like I did better than the guy in front of me today. So I might have shrunk the gap yeah. and I'm fighting for second place. Oh, what I happened? Walked, did we lose I a guy? After two yeah. Oh. The guy in, originally in second who was running high eights, his transmission was kaput yesterday oh. and he didn't get a chance to make a lick because they closed early. So you're behind the gray firebird then i don't know, I don't know yeah the is. first place guy is uh gray 69 firebird but yeah randy yeah, I don't know what he drives, though. it's I a gray 69 firebird big block pontiac okay. power lots of nitrous okay so he's he's leading the pack and then it was the guy named nick and a g-body and then it was me and another guy fighting well, originally i wasn't fighting with him i was ahead of him and then my right. car's been silly and then we started to fight and then yesterday I had a bad day and he had a good day and so 
he got ahead of me, and so today maybe I shrunk the gap. So we'll see. If I yeah. get this thing to do something tomorrow, we might come back around him. That's the excitement. So tune yeah. in for that. This won't air before that. So yeah, it won't air. Yeah. <laughs> the results will be out before anybody sees this. But remember, like and subscribe, Big Buck Bob. You heard it first here. Well, maybe not first, but you heard it somewhere after. You it definitely happened. heard it here, though. <laughs> See ya. I stayed in it because it was Jeff. The car's still not happy, even running the different fuel systems to feed it. It's not fuel issue to me. It's it's ignition again. Affect the average, and. We'll see how it goes in Darlington. We're going to try something else. I think what we're going to do is go to the Summit trailer right away, see if we can get a new cap and rotor for this MSD distributor.